Chris and Larry family. So I get a lot of people asking what I do in order to stay home with the kids. We run a laser business with custom signs and jewelry and then our goat milk soap and lotion. Um, so I want to give you an idea of what I do here and I've got to go to the hardware store today. So I may get Larry on his day off to take me and go with me. Um, to have a day out, but I'm sitting in my studio. So my computer is in front of me. Um, and behind me, you can see the lit up, the big white machine here. That is, um, one of my laser machines. So I'm going to show you what I do and what I'm working on right now is an FFA, uh, award project, um, that, uh, they contacted me. I've got a whole list. 40 signs that I'm working on um, and it's for grand champion and reserve champion beef hog um, lamb and market goat so that's what initially we're doing so let me show you what I work on and kind of what I'm listening to this is how I'm able to watch a lot of your videos on YouTube in between projects because I'm running my machine now, when I do run my machine, it gets fairly loud in here. So I actually wear earplugs to listen um, through my computer if I'm doing that. And then I also do other projects at the same time. So while the laser machine's running, I may be doing some sublimation work. Um, we do tumblers and and uh, pop sockets and, and that kind of thing as well that we sell at some of the different craft shows that we go to. So check it out. So right here I'm in Adobe Illustrator and I've drawn out the initial tag. We're actually going to be attaching another piece on the top of the award that's the different animal. So this one you can see is Grand Champion Prospect Swine. So this is just one of the 40 signs that we're putting together. So I've got my letters in here with my award. I've got a blank space here. This has in that is the Chino Valley FFA and who sponsored it. And then the outside here is actually the, it's a shape of a tag. So I've saved this and I've loaded it into, um, my laser program. So here it is. Now I picked that I wanted the tag outside cut and I want all the words, um, etched in. So engraved in and I've got my different settings here that I you can see we do lots of different custom projects so I grab my settings it's all set I've hit that I want it to be cut and I'm looking right here and it's actually off the edge so we're gonna cancel this print now it's a 45 minute cut and engrave so I have to make sure that this goes through the right way so we're just going to move this up just a hair, make sure that it's hitting on all sides. And if not, I may have to adjust my piece of wood in there. Now you can see if I go off the edge, it changes the color. So I know that it's not cutting right there. So let's see what it does. So now I hit my print button and it says it's getting ready, preparing my print and, and print and cut are the same thing on this program. Um, it's not actually printing anything. It's actually laser etching and cutting and engraving and doing all that. So this is what we're working on right now. So it says it's calculating. It's 44 minutes long. We'll double check that I can see all my edges are on my wood there. And we're going to go over to the machine and hit the button. Okay, now I'm standing over here at my machine. You can see the button is glowing and it's ready for me to hit. Now, once I do hit this, it gets really loud in here really fast. There's fans in here that start pulling all the, the smoke and that out. And I'll just have that for a second because, like I said, it's loud. And if you're not used to it, it's kind of a crazy...
All right, y'all, so I've got wood that I picked up from Lowe's. Um, we get a specific plywood that's in, um, uh, for the signs that we cut. Um, so that's in here. I've got to get home and cut them the rest of the way down to fit into our laser machine. Larry just ran into Walmart to get another bag of dog food um, because we've got four dogs and we go through food quite a bit. I uh, wanted to make sure that we didn't run low at home. So once we get home, and it's about a 30 minute drive from where we're at to where our home is, I have to get back in my studio today to finish up. I've got uh, like six more, seven more signs to do. So those will get done today and get painted tomorrow and ready for pickup on Thursday.